Uh, so welcome back. Uh, at time of recording, uh, we are exactly six weeks out, or six weeks out as of yesterday. Uh, this is just a short summary of kind of some of the top sets that I've had over the last few weeks. Um, in terms of pain experience and in terms of how I feel, it's a bit strange uh, now. It's kind of evolved somewhat and become more of a... Uh, a speed or a volume driven pain experience um the other times that i'm most well the times that i'm mostly experiencing pain kind of in this like right ql up the erector group kind of in, into my spinal erectors and then kind of up into the bottom of my lats is as i unlock my hips or as i deload my spine at the top of a deadlift so you'll see that i'm not putting the deadlifts down in the same manner i might have done before um other times are when I'm going to stand up fully from a squat. So you'll see in both this and, and the other single that's attached in this video, I almost actively stand up slowly because that's when I experience most pain. Uh, the more aggressive or harder that I lock out, the worse it seems to be. And strangely, I'm almost incapable of doing reps. I think where I like reset my brace and reset my position that's when I experience most pain and it, uh, where I become kind of most fragile. Frustratingly too, my bench this week in particular has just hasn't felt there. Both my pec and shoulder, pec on the left and shoulder on the left, uh, just felt really, really terrible. So the week before this week had, had seen some pretty good pressing. Um, 137 for some easy fours, 150 I think think I saw in a week or so there uh, and it's just a little bit all over the place. Outside of uh, this pain experience I do have to say that I am feeling extremely excited to compete. Uh, the squat singles and the bench singles seem to be progressing almost linearly uh, although high bar now seems to be off the cards. I think it's due to the extended pattern and nature of high bar potentially is what's kind of aggravating my hip and lower back. But I have to say that overall, it's improving. Um, accessories are going well. They're all moving forward. Uh, it's just a little bit frustrating now, but the singles are moving. And at the end here, you'll see 272 move pretty well, especially considering the circumstances. Anyway, uh, thanks for your time, and I'll speak to you soon.